Hello again, Razorback fans, and welcome to Razor Vision. We're glad you're with us. Over the years, the Razorback football uniform has captured the imagination of young and old alike. And today we're joined by our Vice Chancellor and Director of Athletics, Jeff Long, to unveil the Razorbacks' newest look. And Jeff, it's an exciting time. Obviously, it's a time that Razorback fans have been talking about. And one of the really great things I think people are going to see is respect for the past, and yet you do embrace that modern idea. Well, Chuck, yes. I think we, we have a time now that we need to update our uniforms. We see it happening all around us. And uh, I think when our fans see our uniforms, they'll see that we have tried to become more cutting edge, but at the same time paying respect to the traditions that are Arkansas, that are uniquely Arkansas. Image and identity play such a big role in college athletics now. How do these uniforms affect that? Well, you know, we talk a lot about branding, and I've talked about it over the last four or five years, and sometimes, you know, people didn't quite understand it. But branding for us is everything that our fans see. And, you know, our uniforms are an important part of branding, not only our athletic programs, but our university. So when people turn on the television and see the Arkansas Razorbacks playing, they immediately identify who we are. And we think these uniforms do that, and they keep it Again, keeping paying respect to the traditions, but again, putting us in the cutting edge and putting us in something that our student athletes love to compete in. Well, it's certainly an exciting time for us to be able to provide this exclusive unveiling on Razor Vision. But before we get to the newest look, let's take an historical look at what got us to this point today. For more than a century, the Razorbacks have served as the defining symbol of not just a university, but for the entire state of Arkansas. At the forefront has been the Razorback football program, which has produced 50 individual All-Americans, 244 different all-conference selections, 13 conference titles, four SEC Western Division crowns, and a national championship. Under pressure, can't spot an open receiver. Throws back, wide open, touchdown, Arkansas! Number Thanks to its long and distinguished history, the Razorback football program continues to shape the very identity of the state it represents. The football program has brought national recognition to the state on many occasions, but none more notable than on January 1st, 1965, when Arkansas defeated Nebraska in the Cotton Bowl to complete a perfect 11-0 season. He waits. It's over. And it's Arkansas 10, Nebraska 7. There are yells and hugs and repeated shots that claim we're number one. We're number one. The Razorbacks were crowned national champions by the Football Writers Association of America after finishing the season as the only undefeated team in the country following the bowl games. Throughout its history, the Razorbacks have played in some of college football's biggest games. With 39 bowl game appearances to its credit, Arkansas has hoisted the championship trophy at many of college football's traditional bowl destinations. From the win over fourth-ranked Georgia in the 1969 Sugar Bowl, to the pounding of number two Oklahoma in the 1978 Orange Bowl, and most recently a victory over 11th-ranked Kansas State in the 2012 Cotton Bowl, Arkansas has competed and won on college football's biggest stages. After 78 years in the Southwest Conference, Arkansas joined the Southeastern Conference and played its first season in the SEC in 1992. Since joining the SEC, the Razorbacks have played in the conference championship game three times and participated in 12 bowl games. Team success has also brought about individual recognition with history of Razorback All-Americans stemming all the way back to 1929 more than eight decades later, punt returner Joe Adams became the 20th consensus All-America in school history following the 2011 season. In the last two seasons, Arkansas has won 21 games, tied for the most wins in a two-year span in program history, played in the school's first BCS game, and earned a top five ranking in the final AP poll of 2011 for the first top five finish since 1977. 
The 2012 season promises to be another exciting chapter in program history as Arkansas and apparel partner Nike team up to debut new uniforms designed specifically for the Razorbacks. With a nationally ranked squad set to take the field for one of the most anticipated home schedules in recent history, the 2012 University of Arkansas football team will bring a new look to a tradition-rich program and help inspire the passion and Razorback pride of an entire state. Well, now we are joined by the head coach of the Razorbacks, John L. Smith. And Coach Smith has really gotten the opportunity to get the first reaction from the players. And, Coach, I hear they love them. What's, what's been the well, reaction? The players have been in my office every day, Chuck. They come in, Coach, wear the uniforms. Uh, <laughs> to get anything done, I've had to hide them. But uh, they're truly, truly excited and fired up. And I really believe, you know, that Nike has tried to, and we have tried to, salvage and keep the old tradition, the traditional colors, but yet add something new and make it new and exciting and modern. Well, you've heard a lot about it. In fact, you've even been teased a little bit. So let's take a look at the new Razorback uniforms. Coach, I think one of the things that catches people's attention, the uniform design, the, the potential for combinations, How's that going to work? How are those going to be selected? Well, again, Chuck, with uh, 100 different players, uh, you're going to have probably 100 different ideas. It's, it's just a matter of, uh, you know, the different combinations are surely we're going to take a look at what the kids want to wear. So that ideas will come from there. And then, of course, what the fans want to see as well. You know, Nike's been known for being on the cutting edge uh, as far as enhancing players' performance, not just with the design, but actually enhancing their performance. Specifically, what, what can these uniforms do for the Arkansas players? Well, again, Nike has done a tremendous job in, uh, like you say, in, in new design. They're lighter, they're tighter, and they're cooler. And basically, those three things. Uh, so, again, it's going to be a lighter, tighter, cooler design that, that helps us perform better. I hear players say, makes us look fast. <laughs> Is that something as a coach and a player our, you our think play, about? Our players are big believers. That, you know what, Coach? If you look good, you play good. And hopefully that will be the case. Well, the uniforms are handled by Chuck Hall. He's the equipment manager for the Razorback football program, and, and really he does a lot more than just that. He has been involved in this from the get-go, and let's turn to Chuck and find out a few more specifics about the new uniforms. Well, I was asked to um, move forward with a different look, a different feel for the, the, the team. So I contacted Nike, and, and, and they actually sent out two people to sit here all day and research the tradition. The material from Nike is more of a high performance. It really stays lighter, uh, drier for the players for longer term, which wicks the moisture away, uh, keeps them cooler, so they don't have to dehydrate as quick or anything like that. Just the performance base of it is so much better than what we used to have here. Uh, the new material will help the players perform, keep them tighter, uh, more fitting to each player, uh, I like the new Arkansas Razorback jerseys. They fit real good. Um, I think it's a great look. Uh, I think it's a great fit. Um, I'm just anxious to get to play in them. Every year in my high school, we got new jerseys every year. But this, it was nothing like this. This is really big time, for real. We wanted to create a new edge. It's, it's really important to get to the modern, new look for the, not only the current players, but the future Razorbacks. Um, we wanted to, to push the envelope, and so what we did was one of the team uh, motivation things was ring the bell. Well, we put that in the back of the neck for the players, so when they put it on game day, they know it's time to, to go meet their goals. Well, when we ring the bell, especially as a football team, it's when we achieve our personal best, um, both as individually um, and as a team effort um, on the field and in the weight room. And uh, you know, so by putting it on our jerseys, it, it reminds us as we slip it on that, that hey, we're going to go achieve achieve our personal best. The other thing we did, we created kind of a new font, the number font. It was based on a razor's edge, like a, a razor is really sharp on the edge, and we did that with a number font. Uh, the, another thing we did was the hog, as you'll see the full hog and the V of the neck for the tradition, but we changed it on the gray uniform, it was just the head of the hog. Just the little things like that, just subtle changes to make it a little different for that third uniform, but we wanted to stay core to our tradition, which was the hog on the helmet, and, and on the jersey as well. Players are very excited. They, they are just excited to have something new, something fresh looking, something where they, the players are all about looking good, feeling good, play good, uh, and they're really excited about that, all the way down to the Red Sox. 
Red Sox. Something simple, but they're very excited about that. It all ties into what we want to do here by pushing the envelope and, and having the players performing well. And if they look good, they're happy, and they can go perform well. The only one word that came to my mind when I seen all, all three styles of the jersey was swag. You know, that's the one word. That, um, we always talk about having swag on the field, and I say the jersey's going to help us bring that out. Make us play better because when it's tighter and smaller, feel like you can run faster so you can get more tackles and I guess get more yards when you run the ball. Obviously, I like the new feel. Uh, I think uh, that's the, the excitement inside the locker room. Everybody's seen them. Uh, they give us a little different flavor, a little little new uh, new era for Arkansas football, and, and uh, I think it's great we, we bring them out this year. I think um, it will draw a lot of recruits' eyes. You know, they see uniforms like this. Um, on Saturday nights and I'm playing big time ball. This is the SEC. It's all about tradition. It's football um, and it's Arkansas. And we didn't want to lose that. That that itself has been built over all these years. It's tradition. It's what we are. However, we wanted to be able to be on the new modern, up-to-date uniform materials, the look, uh, the future Razorbacks, everything. So we had a very unique process of, of keeping everything tied together but not lose who we are. Nike does a, a great job of knowing where the future lies of what, you know, doing their research and development. They're working on stuff for years to come already. Um, they do a great job knowing where we need to go. We just take what we've done in the past and what the players like and put all three together and then this is what it comes out to be. Well, it is a great look. And as we're joined again by Jeff Long, Jeff, we can tell it's not an overnight process. And I wonder, as you went through this process, what were some of the things you wanted to accomplish? Well, well number one, we wanted to make sure our student athletes had the, the latest and greatest in technology when it comes to uniforms. You know, partnering with Nike has given us not only great shoe apparel, or shoes to wear, but it's also provided us the greatest technology in uniform. So providing the lightweight material, the new designs have really helped uh, improve our ability to compete for our, with our student athletes. And when you talk about respecting tradition, uh, guiding principles, things that you wanted to make certain you did not get away from as you came up with this design. Yeah, well, the, you know, the cardinal red that we have and our white, that's our basic look and we wanted to make sure that we had that. We have introduced some other combinations in here because we also think that brings something to the table with our fan base, with our our branding but you know we're never going to go away from our cardinal and red that's what's really important to us but at the same time we've provided some exciting options as well well yeah that's that's the staple the cardinal and white but as we've seen there, there are some specialty items as well there are you know we can do a little mixing and matching uh, I think overall though we've been very conservative in what we've done with our uniform here we've made it cutting edge we've made it uh, futuristic somewhat uh, but at the same time we stayed conservative we've not gone wild with it and again that's some what with the respect to the past as well but I think we've got a clean sharp uniform that our fans are gonna love I know our student athletes love it so uh, it's gonna be great to see the Razorbacks run out on a Royals field next fall in those new uniforms you know, we'll see them uh, the nation will see them as well as we've discussed with coach Smith recruiting is always part of this as well and and these uniforms are certainly something that will be eye-catching well, they are and recruiting was part of the reason for for uh, designing a new uniform I, I have to be honest about that it's not the only reason but it's something that we have to pay attention to you know we watch our competitors we measure ourselves against our competition and you know we've seen a number of schools across the nation introduce uh, new uniforms so we were in a position we were ready to do that and excited to do that Jeff they look great I'm excited for next season. I am too, Chuck. Thank you. And we hope you are as well, and we look forward to bringing you coverage of the Razorbacks right here on Razor Vision, so stay with us as we look forward to next football season.